The Boyne Water by Anonymous Read for LibriVox.org by Daily Bub July the 1st of a morning clear 1690 King William did his men prepare Of thousands he had thirty To fight King James and all his foes Encamped near the Boyne Water He little feared though two to one Their multitude to scatter King William called his officers, saying, Gentlemen, mind your station, and let your valour here be shown before this Irish nation. My brazen walls let no man break, and your subtle foes you'll scatter. Be sure you show them good English play as you go over the water. Both foot and horse they marched on, intending them to batter but the brave Duke Schomburg he was shot as he crossed over the water. When that King William did observe the brave Duke Schomburg falling, he reined his horse with heavy heart on the Enniskillens calling, What will you do for me, brave boys? See yonder men retreating. Our enemies encouraged are. The English drums are beating. He says, My boys feel no dismay at losing one commander, for God shall be our king this day and I'll be general under. Within four yards of our forefront, before a shot was fired, a sudden snuff they got that day, which little they desired. For horse and man fell to the ground, and some hung on their saddle, others turned up their forked ends, which we call coup de ladle. Prince Eugene's regiment was the next, on our right-hand side advanced into the field of standing wheat, where Irish horses pranced, but the brandy ran so in their heads, their senses all did scatter. They little thought to leave their bones that day at the Boyne water. Both men and horses lay on the ground, and many there lay bleeding. I saw no sickles there that day, but sure there was sharp shearing. Now praise God, all true Protestants, and heavens and earth's creator, for the deliverance he sent our enemies to scatter. The church's foes will pine away like churlish-hearted Nabal, for our deliverer came this day like the great Zorbabal. So praise God, all true Protestants, and I will say no further, but had the papists gained the day, there would have been open murder. Although King James and many more were ne'er that way inclined, it was not in their power to stop what the rabble they designed. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.